Hey guys, Civilian here, back with another review, and today we're having a look at the Hero Factory Brain Attack Series 2, or Wave 2. Um, set number 44010. Uh, today we're having a look at Stormer. Now, uh, sorry this review is a bit late. Um, I haven't had much time to record. My friend's been over a lot this week and I've been waking up damn near one o'clock most of the time so I haven't had a lot of review time so that aside um apologize for the language as well I know probably kids watching this but I just haven't had a lot of time and it's really stressful school is three two and a half days I'm gonna say away and it sucks because I don't really it's not a comfortable place to go. <laughs> um, it just isn't. It's cold, it's crowded, it's loud, it's everything I hate. I mean, I can stand the cold, but if it's loud and crowded, I can't. But we're going to review a Lego set, not rant about how school is crowded, loud, and cold. And very, very uh, offensive as well. Obviously, it's high school, right? Well, here we have uh, the manual for Stormer. Um, same stuff as on the bag, which we'll get to in a minute. Uh, opening it up here, you can see a little mini comic. Oh my god, it's Satan. No, it's just Pyrox. Um, ah. I hate my nose so much. It chooses to leak when I'm recording or trying to do a test. And it sucks. It's very annoying. Why do I need allergies to top off the bad crap I'm already dealing with? Couldn't tell you. Um, this guy has 24 minus 3. So we're going to call that... 21 pages of building. Good enough. Um, some extra bits to someone on the floor here. And then, uh, looking at the packaging, it's the bag, as always. And sorry, that was in a little bit. Uh, ages 7 to 14, set number 44010. And uh, 69 pieces. That's a decent amount, right? Uh, there he is. Logo would have been up there, but I cut it off. And then on the back, it shows you what he does. Surprisingly, I did not cut his forehead off. It says if you take Frost Beast, you can make a Monster Hunter combo model. Practically what it's saying. Alrighty, that's enough of that. Having a look at the figure. He's pretty nice. Um, I will give him that. Uh, he does have the visor that flips up, and his face is kind of scrunched. I wish his eyes were a little bit further out, but they didn't have much room to do that. So I suppose that works. It looks better with the visor down anyway. Most people, I assume, will have the visor down. Um, he's got this awesome ice shield. Well, shield in general, and it can also looks like uh, it'll dent you up with this little, uh, I suppose, bashing spot. I don't know what this ice spike is for, but I assume he can jab you with that as well. He's also got these spikes on his shoulders. Uh, I swear to God, if they make a uh, DC Superheroes uh, uh, Ultra Build Doomsday... There goes the phone. If they make a doomsday with these, that would be awesome. I'm going to go see who that is. Be right back. Sorry about that. Um, Just had to go see who that was. Now, um, where were we? Oh, yeah, the, the spikes. Yeah, if they made a DC Superheroes doomsday uh, ultra build, they should definitely use these in bulk. <laughs> um, then he's also got the core that's covered up by these little uh, arms with, I suppose they're like claw bits or something like that, but I have mine all the way down just so, well, it looks a little more natural that way. And he also has this awesome sword 
I like this this sword. It's much better constructed. It's constructed better than the uh, Stormer XL sword. That one's sword was kind of loose fitting, and the blades were uh, wonky looking. This one is nice and sharp and awesome. Really do like it. Now, uh, his legs are standard. He's got these clear bits, though, which a lot of people like. Lego Jang, especially. Um, and he also has this little backpack assembly where he's got uh, flip up missiles. Um, okay, I suppose that works. Now, these are just flick fires, so you basically take it and you. You're gonna want to have it so you can see it. They just shoot out like that. Well, decent amount. Um, but you take them and you flick them more if you're like me. You're lazy and you just push them. And they don't go anywhere. Except in between the review station and the box is all jacked up. Sorry about that. Adjusting my stupid camera, which always goes out of whack. Or it gets thrown out of whack. I'll we'll just zoom in a bit here. And there we go. My apologies. Um, I suppose I can move up closer now. Um, yeah, that's all the gimmicks anyway. Uh, articulation, he's got all the standard Hero Factory articulation you would expect from, well, a standard uh, set, I suppose. And, uh, yeah, that's really it. Um, you know, he's got the ball jointed head, shoulders, elbows, hips, knees, feet, hands. Much better articulation than some stuff we're getting from Mattel and Asbro, though. But a size comparison, uh, there he is. And, uh, here is his, uh, nemesis, I suppose, in this series, the Frost Beast. I don't know why mine's spine is all whacked out. It's all sticking up to one side, kind of like my hair in the morning. Uh, but there's the Frost Beast. Stay up, you. Why, why are you turning, everyone? There we go. And as you can see, Frost Beast has a much larger face, but he's not that much taller than him. But he is bulkier. He is slightly bulkier. So, that's him. Nice comparison. Over. So, yeah, that's about all I have to say for Stormer. Um, I'm going to give him... Let's see, what did I give Frostbeast? I think I gave him like a 9. I think I'm going to give this guy a 10. I don't really see any problems with him. Uh, he's well covered. He's... Well, he's poseable. He's got a few action features. He's got two, three weapons and the flip up visor thing so he's good in playability so yeah I don't see really any problems with this figure so hope you guys enjoyed my review of the Hero Factory uh, Brain Attack Series 2 or Wave 2 yeah. Marvel Select Venom Strikes Again uh, um, Stormer he is of course set number 44010 or 010 whatever uh, 69 pieces, and he's ages 7 to 14. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this review, and until next time, I will see you guys later. Peace!